All right, that was one contract. Let's do the other one that was like level 13 or whatever. Yeah. Where's this one at? That's the business. Working man over here. For sure. Okay, a lot of those yellow markers that were on the map are gone now. They must. A lot of them must have been the same quest marker. They just put it at a lot of the notice boards. All right, oh, this one's actually in town. Interesting. Well, can I just go there? <sighs> the be at a signpost to get there. Where's the nearest one? I don't want to go to the orphans of Crookback. Crookback, do I? Run, exactly. Roach. I'll gladly pay you Tuesday for a dead monster today. It's like, no, no, you are going to pay me today. And you can get your own money back on Tuesday, bitch. <laughs> Fuck that. Get up. I guess you're having a burger on Tuesday, homie, because you ain't having one today. Run, Roach. I got roaches to feed, you know what I mean? God damn it. Let's go. I'm just trying to get over to this dang spot, and I don't. I really wish you could just fast travel from anywhere to one of the fast travel spots. I wonder if that's a, like an item or an item to unlock later. Oh boy, there's wraiths everywhere over here. Whoop de doo. I don't really want to fight you guys right now. I'm just kind of, I'm over it. Wait, where am I? Oh, fuck. I'm at Down Warren? How the hell? I got all turned around. Man, some of these things are like way closer together than they look. There's, there's my sign. I was just looking for the sign. I truly don't want to fight any of you guys. Okay, let's get to where I'm going. Back to Novigrad area. In fact, back to inside Novigrad for that matter. Maybe I'll do one more hunt, and then since we're back in Novigrad anyway, this area, we'll just go straight to Dandelion after this and see what he has. Because he has a side quest as well. The ones that involve our homies or people we know, we should do those ones. And anything that involves Dandelion, we should do. Oh, Alright, dude. Greetings, what must master. I kill? Hear about the contract. Really got an imp problem? Or is that just an imp perfection in the notice? Oh my god. Ought not Geralt did not master just make Witcher. that pun, though. I know the creatures are only to existing fairy tales. Yet I saw one with my own eyes as it stole from my stall. All right. So what's this imp look like? Like a mean, fat cat, but a very large one. Uh, this tall, see? And it walked upon its hind paws. What did it swipe from you? Once it was bread, uh, then a fish, then apples might not seem like much but add it together and the business suffers i mean that's all food so this thing must be hungry pestered, it's nicked something from every stand in the square so will you teach it a lesson with your silver sword <sighs> depends on the pay homie make it worth my while and i will demand for witches is high supplies low i pick and choose my contracts these days all right again we're gonna go We'll go 300, see what he says. A bit much, but a compromise is in sight. Okay. What about like 295? A bit. Okay. What about like 290? Uh, okay. What about dude, like 280? A bit. Damn it. Okay. 275. Find the goose. There we go. On your part, master. So be it. We'll call it agreed. Hell yeah. Give me my money, bitch. Relax. Give me my money. I'll help you. Small businesses are the foundation of a healthy economy, and so on and so on. <laughs> so on and so forth. And blase, Thank you, blase. Master Witcher. I don't know if this will be of use, but most recently the thief leapt over that wall and ran into a passageway. It was the last I saw of him and a few of my wares. Well, at least I have a direction to go in. Running around in this rain. So we're going. Merchant was right. Actually does look like a giant cat. Big kitty paws, okay. All right, well, what, what, where are we going? Hello? Ah, this away. Okay. Follow the giant kitty. 
Follow the giant kitty. Follow the kitty, 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 giant fat kitty. This is scandalous. Looks like the imp dropped some loot. Oh. Another track. I see. Ah! Sure about that. Ears look a shade. Interesting. It's like climbing it along the wall. Down the moat. Trail ends here. We ow. Does it end here though? Nope. Goes over to here. DJ should have been here for that pun. I mean, he would have survived. He probably would have did more puns Doors with you. Wide open. Interesting. Mm, maybe it's somebody who's turned into this thing. Hmm. Let's see. A letter. Well, well. Our imps at least literate, if not outright educated. Well, well. Huh. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Okay. A Doppler. Explains a lot. And complicates matters. Need a good lead to track him down. Those Dopplers can be hard to catch. Okay, wait. Find a way to track the Doppler using Witcher senses. I mean, find a way? There must be some some kind of clue up in this bitch. Yeah. There's a clue. A clue. A clue. I'm not sure if that's a joke. Uh, another pun there. Frog. Might have gone over my, go over my head a little bit. Gone over my head a little bit. Ever heard of spring -Heel Jack? Look it up. I'm not sure if that's supposed to be another joke or if I'm just being dumb or what. A woman's blouse, a man's shirt, a child's shoes, but only one bed. Lavender, strong scent, enough to track him down. Oh, it's actually a 19th century weird incident. Oh, you're just actually asking me about a thing. Okay. But maybe there was like a pun there that I wasn't getting. So there's some spring heeled jack. I've never, no, I have not heard of spring heeled jack. I'll have to think about it later. I'm not going to look it up while I'm streaming, but if anybody else is here, you know, feel free to look it up and see what the hell he's talking about, because I have ah. no idea. All I have. I don't know for bread too, but drop. Rare sight. An elf and a guard of the Eternal Fire having a friendly chat. Friendly? Nothing further from the truth. This racist here has demanded to search me for no reason at all. Use a non-human, I need no other reason. Lucky I didn't find anything on you. Now piss off to the woods. Go play your flute. That was some pretty bad acting. Really ought to explore other career options. Petty theft, maybe. You dare insult an officer on duty? Let me give you some advice, mutant. Look who's talking. I know you're a Doppler and a kleptomaniac. Merchants put out a contract on me. Damn right they did, bitch. Better run, <sighs> Imp. Always the same old shit. Same old shit. Time to chase him down. Here we go. Hey, wait. Get back here. I'm not finished with you. Why are you leaving my okay? Easy catch. Now we get to fuck him up. Really want to see an angry witcher. Do you? <laughs> He's going to be me, isn't he? Yes, he is. Damn, I look old. <laughs> Fight yourself. Oh, shit. He's even got my ability. Okay. You want to have my abilities? Bitch. I didn't mean to use Ken, but you know what it works. Ow. Oh, fuck yeah. Get fucked, homie. Please, stop. I surrender. You can't be me. Might be able to look you like a me. witcher. Bitch. That make you fight like one. You're donning your skins enough to know what kind of man you are. What you feel. Uh, I mean, he doesn't seem like he's anything like he needed to die, but just get the fuck out of here, homie. I don't kill him, true. But then not everybody applies my rules, and not everyone's got my conscience. So start stealing somewhere else. Far from Novigrad, preferably. Golden Age of Dopplers ended here a while ago. Oh no, but I thought they'd not catch me. I thought myself too smart. 
Serves me right. Might have learned this lesson the hard way. Time to go. Somewhere far away. But first, take this as a token of my gratitude. So long, Witcher. Well, GG on that. Also, there's another goddamn exclamation point over here. What the hell is this? God damn it. Enough. Leave him alone. Oi, you are non human of Oh, is another one it? of these again. Okay. If there's one thing I hate, it's to repeat myself. Leave him be. Hey, lads. Got one eager for a lick in here. So be Let's it. Let's show him what happens to freak lovers in Novigrad. So be it, homie. Ah! Y'all are going to pull out your swords. Guess who's pulling out a sword also? This guy. Ooh, bye bye to your dome, Holmes. And your dome. Bye bye. There's always something going on with Thank these people. You, I know, girl. right? If you hadn't intervened, they'd have snipped my ears like they did Phalar's. Or worse. Well, you're alive. Now get the fuck out of here. I'd leave Novigrad if I were you. How about that? Non humans bother you as well? Me? No. The Eternal Fire, yes. They've got other scapegoats to burn right now, but it won't be long before they come for you. I don't believe they will. They'd not dare go that far. I was in Rivia in 1268, during the massacre. Know exactly what I'm talking about. Alright, see you. Take care of yourselves now. Meaning? What would you have me do? Never leave my home? Step off the pavement to let a human pass? Farewell. Yeah, fuck you too. You can you figure it out. I'm out. See ya. What would you have me do? I don't give a fuck what you do. You figure it out, bitch. I was just here to make sure you didn't get murdered on the spot. But yeah, Duke, there's always something going on around these towns. You never know what the hell you're gonna run into, man. It's always super interesting Wonderful. with these big open games that have lots of things going on. Anyway, let's just turn this fucking shit in. Here I am. Doing everything I can. Greetings, master. Problem solved. Convince the imp to go back to the countryside to tangle horse manes and piss in milk, as tradition ordains. And how would I know you speak the truth? No trophy, no reward. There better be one. Or you'll feel the invisible hand of the market smack you so hard you won't be able to sit down for a week. <laughs> I'll give you half the agreed sum, no more. And I'll not do business with you again. That's fine. I'll take my half and you can fuck right off. Bitch. The Doppler effect. I got an achievement for that one. It was called the Doppler effect. Just wondering if, if you're wondering why I said what I just said. Look around the area. Wait, what is this one? I'm actually kind of curious what this one is. Look around what area? Oh, wow. Way the hell over here? I don't want to do that one right now. Fuck that. Never mind. <laughs> All right. Uh, meet Dijkstra. Ooh, we have another Dijkstra quest to do too. Man. Oh my God, Philippa's hideout. Man, I got so many things to do. I kind of want to do that one too. But anyway, let's go talk to Dandelion for now. I definitely want to do the one for Dijkstra. I definitely want to do the one that has to do with Philip as well. If I remember correctly, the Dijkstra one is he wanted me to murder... Uh, he wanted me to murder Radovid, right? Isn't that what he wants me to do? Or at least, like, help murder Radovid. Maybe not necessarily be the one that murders him. The last individual who tried to come in on my business, it took them a month to find him. Am I being clear, Chief A? What's the fuss about? Can you not treat me as a bit of healthy competition? Why are you even talking to him, Duke? I've always maintained two smashed knees are worth a thousand words. <laughs> oh, get out! Logic him. A problem here, sir? There a problem? A problem? There's some kind of problem here, gents. 
Oh. Just wanted you to meet my new pals for the bugger the fuck off. Because we're just parting, right? We'll have our reckoning yet, Chive. Soon. What's this? Some flea ridden mutant got you scared, Duke? Just say the word. I'll take care of him. Take a peek at what he's got inside, then make the midget eat it. Sound good? Next time, Earl. Let's go. Right. Yeah, Earl. Don't show your hides run here ever again. Well, that puts me up to the neck in fucking shade without the shovel. Shady, those guys. Who were they? Uh, puffed up fish bladders, Duke. What does he's out to be the new horse son junior, but the bugger's missing a hell of a lot. Specifically coin, influence, men, and class. And the other? Errol. A scum jug like few others. Skin of my arse twitches at the sight of him. Back in Mahakam, we'd send so buggers like that down the coalface with a bundle of powder and a leaky lamp. What's this all about? Doing business with them? Exactly the plowing opposite. You see, Geralt, old pal... About to ask me for help, aren't you? The thing is, I sort of kind of owe a wee sum to a mutual acquaintance. Francis Bedlam, the king of beggars. To pay off the debt, I've made up my mind to get serious about Gwent. Getting better by the minute. Not the playing of it, mind you, but the cards themselves. The rarest of them fetch princely sums these days. Sadly, that's not exactly arcane knowledge. Got a buyer in heat for my collection, missing just three cards. But Duke's dregs are all over my arse, so... What do you say, Gareth? Time to get some Gwent cards for my boy. Fine. We'll try to hunt down those cards. Which ones you need? Fringilla, Vigo, Isengrim, and John Natalis. Devilish hunt to get Fringilla? Interesting. Duke's been trying too, hasn't had any luck. We haven't had a Fringilla Wait, in the game yet. you know where yet. to look for these cards? Nah, it's not as bad as that. But I have met her in the show. Betting Zed's got them. He quit fencing recently. Only deals in cards now. Unfortunately, the arsewipe won't talk to me. Not after I bought a one-of-a-kind Scoyatel carved out from under his nose. Boy, would you mind going to see him? Zed. Hmm, sounds familiar. Big fish in the card pond. There's a shop along the south wall. And thank you, Geralt. I actually think I stand to pay off this debt now. No problem. See you later, Zoltan. Funny that this has to do with cards. I actually like that. This is true. We can go at it here. Oh, oh, my. Hey. All right. Well, welcome to the cabaret, baby. I know. I guess we're gonna talk to Dandelion after we oogle at all of his girls. Anyway, all right, all right. Calm your tits, children. What are we arguing about? She spat in my face. Or might as well have. Called me a whoremonger and a witless hack. Can you imagine? Wit is my forte. Gotta say, Priscilla's really growing on me. Save it. And why don't you save your pouting? Prove to her she's wrong. Exactly what I plan to do. I've always dreamed of having my own cabaret. A bit of paint and plaster, and this place will do splendidly. Just one hitch. I need coin. So, if you happen to get a break between drowners and jigs. Maybe you can help an old friend out. What do you need? How can I help you? I dated this girl once, Sophronia. That's a name if you can believe it. Has a merchant for a father, importer of spices from Zeracania. And Daddy Deer would never refuse his daughter Deer a thing. We can borrow the coin from her. Uh, what? Name rings a bell. Isn't this the woman you abandoned without saying a word? Stepped out for a bottle of wine, never to return? I knew I bought that wine for a reason. Long time ago, that. Been away a while, sure. Which is why I need to draw on your authority. You've got some, you know. No matter what you might think. Fine. Tell me what you want. 
Got a feeling you've a plan all cooked up. Sophronia could still be holding a grudge after our unfortunate parting. But with a touch of help from you, I know she'll forgive me. And then give me that loan. What's this help entail? First of all, we need to borrow a dull sword from Madame Arena. One of her props. You know, the kind they use during performances? Get that, then meet me outside Sophronia's house. Okay. Let's say I agree and go see Madame Arena. What will you be doing in the meantime? Something I have to finish. But I promise I'll do it before you come back with the sword. Then I'll tell you the rest. Fine. Fine, but... Daryl, the only butts in this plan will be the ones filling my seats. It'll work, you'll see. Get the sword That'll put some Arena butts in the seats. Me outside Sophronia's at sunset. <sighs> okay. Let's go talk to Arena or whatever. Let's schemed up this time. Oh boy. Arena, I need a fake sword. Where you at? We're going to be there in a moment or two. Just got to go hang out with my girl Arena too, baby. Arena, where you at? I'm going to talk to Yoba Jazz soon now. All right, girl, what's up with it? Ah, so good to see you. You and Dude. Oh, you know what? Yes. I don't really care about this. Blood first. Whereas. I don't really care. Got a request. Need to borrow one of your props. One of the swords you use for stage battles. My. Whatever do you need that for? I don't know. But Dandelion claims it's essential. Oh, yes. I suspected Master Dandelion might have a hand in this. I certainly hope you don't aim to compete with me. Well. Thanks. I'll try not to damage it. So long. Don't worry. We're not going to put on a fucking play. The plays are all you, girl. Oh. I'm just over here trying to get Dandelion the money for his whorehouse. I guess the cabaret is an whorehouse, though. We know what a cabaret is. We've played Yakuza. Cabarets where you parade around half-naked women, or at least women and dressed in a way provocative enough, enough to make the males around go woohoo and pay money. That's pretty much the idea of a cabaret. Why are these kids running? And it's not—they're not running for me, are they? I did nothing. I don't even have my weapon out. I'm just running. All right, Dandelion, where art thou? Wait, where the hell is he? Is he above here? Where's this fucker at? I didn't see him down here, did I? Hey, you Dandelion fuck, where are you? Oh, at after dusk, sorry. I didn't catch that after dusk. Probably should have looked at the quest marker, or the quest thing. That would have probably been wise. All right. Well, in that case, after dusk, which is only a few hours away, let's go to here. And, uh, well, here we are. Is this not after dusk? Is this not late enough? Are you fucking kidding me right now? Bro. God. Well, <sighs> bruh. Okay. We're at the right time. Just gotta walk to the right spot. Ah, finally made it. Listen, here's the plan Sophronia loves adventure filled romance novels. I can be a hero in her. I can be your if hero, I can just baby. Save her from a bandit. I'll have her eating out of my hand. And there's no way she'll begrudge me that loan. I can eat away your pain. Want me to be the bandit? Knew you'd see the sense in it right away. Uh, that's it? That's your fucking plan? Are you serious? That's your brilliant plan? I never called it brilliant. 
But any kind of plan is better than none. Written your lines already. You've written what? So you know what to say during the performance. Here, Andromask, put it on. Sophronia can't recognize you. But... No time. Sophronia's coming. Stick to the plan. We'll meet at the Rosemary in the morning. Oh boy. Stop right there. What? What is this? Help! Save me! Free sucker! Tremble, flaxen haired wench. <laughs> Bow before the Prince of Thieves. Not so fast. Not so fast, Jafar! Drop your sword, scoundrel. This is your first and last warning. Dandelion! Tis I, though the scum of the city call me the Crimson Avenger. <laughs> no, not the Crimson Avenger. <laughs> Silence, Vermin! It's too funny. You shall regret the day you were born. Oh no! Crimson Avenger! Ow. I've been hit! Ow! To the house, quickly! He shan't get us there! Well, I hit him once. Eternal fire! What do you want from us? Leave us be! Dude, I hit him once. Oh, we'll soon run off. I'm sure of it. He wouldn't chance getting caught by the guards. Would he? Uh. No. Totally not. Uh, I'm scared. Was I supposed to slice no. Dandelion? I don't even know. I swung once and he went down like a sack of potatoes. No idea if that was how I was supposed to do that, but there you go. I guess we'll just go back to the, 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 the Rosemary in time and see if his uh, plan works. What are we running from? I don't get it. What's so scary? I'm just a witcher. You're supposed to toss coins to me, not run in my presence. Na 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 We can gather it here. In the morning? In the morning, of course. Motherfucker, it ain't morning. Does it matter how early in the morning? 7 a.m.? Is that good? You're here too early. We agreed to meet today, so we've come today. Supplies are all hauled in, and the crew's raring to work. We'll start just as soon as our lovely directress gets round to deciding on the decoration. But Dandelion doesn't even have the coin to pay you. Turns out he does now, or soon will. At any rate, he's working on it. See, it's all pizza. So will you finally decide what style you want for this interior? Hmm. What are our choices? Master Dandelion said he was torn between boudoir style and theater decor. Promised to let us know his choice as soon as we arrived. Now we are here, but no decision's been made. And the lady's horribly surprised she's to choose. <laughs> Though apparently this whole renovation's for her sake. For me? Well, it's not for me. Now, would you please decide where I bust a vessel? I've no idea what Dandelion would like. Geralt, you've known him longer. Say something. I mean, boudoir is better for a cabaret, to be fair. I mean, I could just make her choose, right? But I will say a boudoir would be better for a cabaret, to be fair. Um, shit. Do I make the choice or do I make her choose? Um, I'm going to make the choice. Boudoir! Boudoir seems like a better fit for cabaret. Just don't go overboard on stuffed upholstery. A wonderful choice it is. At last. Gentlemen, you're done lollygagging. Get to work. I mean, it's for the cabaret. Oh, well, guess this cabaret's the real thing. Ever since Dandelion inherited this place, he's talked about it constantly. 
I just never expected him to take action. And so quickly. Who knows? Might even settle down now. I'll have to keep an eye on the business. Who would have known? Despite what people say about him, Dandelion approaches life very rationally. I don't know about that. We talking about the same dandelion? Man who loses a fortune worth half of Novigrad in one night? Dandelion can also be responsible. He always pays anyone who works for him on time, and he's never missed a performance. Sure hope your opening won't be the first. He's still not here. Well, he said as soon as he got the coin, he'd go see Polly, our choreographer. She's missed the last few rehearsals. I certainly hope he's not gotten into trouble. Anything's possible with Dandelion. Which means he Let certainly me has. Here we go. Probably didn't even get the money. Let's go find him. Tra la 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 la. Where is Dandelion at ya? Tra la 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 there he is. Hello. What's the ruckus about? Polly and her half brain fiance. They're fighting. She's the only one in this town who knows anything about choreography, and that lummox won't let her work for me. Why? Oh, hold on. What are you doing here? We were going to meet at the Rosemary. We were, but you didn't show. Priscilla started to worry, so I came to see how you were doing. Priscilla started worrying about me? That's so nice. Less for her than for you, I'm sure. So let's get back. Did you not hear what's going on in there? We've got to help Polly. Why do beautiful women always end up with such dicks? No idea. Stand back. I'll break the door down. Wait! Do we have to destroy her house? She keeps a spare key around here somewhere. Well, I got Witcher senses. Let's find them. How would you know she keeps a spare key around here? It's not as if we started working together yesterday. Before Polly joined forces with Hubio... You'd visit her? Often? I'd hide out here while Priscilla and Polly rehearsed at the Rosemary and Time. They worked on the dance numbers I, I composed. So, Polly's not one of your... I never mix business and pleasure. The one exception being Priscilla. Who you were just saying is worried about us. So enough of the chatter and start looking. Fine. Let's find the key. Witcher senses... There it is. So hard to find. Damn it. No. Not here. It's around here somewhere. Ah, the key. Easy sauce. Easy sauce. Hello, hello. Whoa, what the devil's this? Get out of my ass. Watch it and leave the woman alone. What the f She's my betrothed. But I'm not your property. I love her. I'll not let her sway her ass in his brothel. Whoa, slow down there a minute. This is clearly one gigantic misunderstanding. One I can clear up in the blink of an eye. Shove your excuses up your ass. Shut off, or I'll split your skull. My friend asked you nicely. So please be courteous in return and hear him out, or we'll settle this another way. Yeah, bitch. All right. So <laughs> pop your fucking Ruby, dome, right? homie. Polly's told me so much about you. She said you're erudite and have an open mind. You said that? Well, there's a truth to it. My mind's the open salt. But its open saltedness ends when my betrothed starts wagging her ass around brothels. Get out of here, both of you. Polly's not going anywhere. Let him finish. There's no brothel involved. You see, friend, Geralt just hit the nail on the head. For what you have there, 
is the old publicity placard. Old? Very. From a time when my establishment was under different management. I, however, would never let any indecency take place in my cabaret. My very reputation precludes it. So, what's all this about? Your betrothed is a first-class artiste, and I want to offer her a position worthy of her talents. She's to be my choreographer. And that, in turn, means she'll receive a share of the proceeds from every performance she choreographs. You mean to say, coin? And fame. No flirting required. You have my word. Oh. Suppose, in that case... I knew you'd agree. It's settled, then. See you at the Rosemary, Polly. See? Even a dumbass can be I'm persuaded. Off. I'll catch up to you. She's just gonna shake her ass to teach Ooh. other girls how to shake her their ass. Expected that to go so well. You handled it well, Dandelion. Man was body in your hands once you called him erudite. In negotiation, as in combat, the key is to find your opponent's weak spot and exploit it to the hilt. So, time to head back. I've still got to stop by Rotlex. Commissioned some new placards from him a while ago, but Hubio came across the old version. Plowing artists got some serious explaining to do. Plowing artist. Who's Rotlek? Never heard of him? Hank Rotlek, famous portrait artist? Commissioned a portrait artist to paint your placards? Hank Butlick? Henry's an old friend, needed the coin. And I decided we needed new placards to promote the opening performance. Seats won't fill themselves, you know. I'll go see Rodlick. You head back to the Rosemary. Priscilla will have my head. Really? You'd go? No, said that for the hell of it. Tell me where he lives. No, bitch. Portside. See you soon. All right, I'll be back with your placards. <laughs> BRB with your fucking placards like a fucking champion. All in the name to open the cabaret. What you really need for the cabaret is a Majima. Guru Majima. He can help you run the place. Majima Guru. So he could be like, Daddy Lion Shine. No, that is nice. That wasn't even funny. Just, just walk away. Just, just walk away. Hey, we're all dudes. Hey, he's a dude, she's a dude, and so are we. Hey, let's go. Zelda rocks with the with the subscription, with Prime Gaming, Twitch Prime, whatever. Thank you very much, Christine. I'm assuming that's you. Thank you very much for the sub. Appreciate it, and welcome. How are you tonight? Let's talk to Buttlick over here. Looking for Rotlick. You ain't alone. Damn halfling's in debt to half the city. But I'm here to scrape mine for the carcass is pit clean. There's not enough for everyone, so bugger off. Feeding time's first come, first served. Well, I just want some placards, bitch. Take what you want. I'm just here for some placards. You diff. Didn't you hear me? This is all mine now. Fuck off, freak. All right, well, now you're all dead. <sighs> and here I thought we'd resolve this peacefully. And now you're all fucking dead, too. Oh, they want to throw a fist fight. Okay. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Okay, 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 okay. Anyway, you're doing fine there, Christine. You just got them playing the Switch. What were you playing on the Switch? All right. Can't lose these fools. Come on now. Dude, stop. This small area sucks. Dude. Dude, stop. Alright, alright, alright. Here we go. Got him. Damn, that was close. Tell me what you want. You were Damn playing it. Final Fantasy 7 on the Switch? Nice. I'm assuming you played it before or no? 
And Rotlick, where's he? Same place as always. Vagal but estate. Losing his last crowns at the races. See, wasn't that easy? Could have said so right away. Well, alrighty then. Easy peasy sauce. Alright, we gotta go to the horse races though. That's the place we were at before for that for the dandelion quest before when we went and you know followed one of his girls over there you know i'm i'm pretty sure that's the beagle bud place anyway it's your first time playing ff7 okay cool how are you enjoying it so far how far are you into the game i don't think it's you know spoilery to talk about that game in full final fantasy 7 is an old enough game and everybody around here has mostly played it so you can say how far you are into the game if you know how far you are like what, what part of the game you're on Anyway, we gotta go to the fucking states. Do 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 do. I wish there was another teleport on this left side of the city. Like, oh. There's just not one. I tell you, this city will be I'll tell you. You're on just two, and you're going after the reactor to destroy the big weapon so Midgard doesn't get destroyed, and you're only at level 45. Oh, oh, okay, okay. I see. So you're on, you're on the part where you're about to fight the weapon that's, like, marching at Midgar right now? It's, like, walking through the water to get to Midgar to destroy it? Dang, this place is far away. I didn't remember being that far away. Jesus. Okay. Well, here I am. Ah, yeah, here I am, and here we go. I'm waiting to begin. You actually just did that part. Okay, so you're at the part right after that. Then, okay, fair enough. I mean, I at least know how far you're in the game. That means you're pretty far into the game. Considerable sum in the red. You Rotlick. Henri Rotlick. Artist, painter, debtor, and martyr to my art. At your service. Dandelion sent me. Oh, yes. But tell him his placards are done and safely hidden away. Yet, alas, I cannot fetch them. As a group of angry creditors has seized my home. Think I might have run into one of them. Then you know my predicament. And now, Count de Louverton has offered me the chance to win it all back. I'm the wager on a race. Oh boy. Generous. Not just anybody could afford to do that. Deluverton is not just anybody. He's Duke Sam's youngest son. Sam of the well-known family of gem dealers. One debt more or less makes little difference to him. What's there to worry about? This is your chance to settle up, get a clean slate. You've had a spell of bad luck lately. Should I agree to the Louverton's offer and lose, I shall be in bondage to him for all time. 200 to pay his debt? That's cheap as fuck. I'll win the race for you? I mean, that could be fun. Let's do that. Let's do this. I'll enter the race. You'll bet on me, win, pay your debts, then give me the placards. That sounds like the more, well, that, the most fun right option. Far from the worst. Go tell the Count you accept his offer. Anyway, you had to save and get uh, stop for now on FF7 because you got to get up early. Fair enough. And yes, I have watched the shows on Netflix, uh, Christine. I've actually seen all of it. I'm caught up on season two, so I've seen all of the show. All right, we're going. We got this. We got this. Got this by the ace. Stay in front of them, and then get get your fucking galloping going. I got this. You watched the whole thing in one day? All of season two? Yeah, me and Morrow actually watched all of it within, like, within 24 hours. It took us two days, technically, but yeah. We watched it all pretty fast. It's pretty good. 
Aw, oh, dang, you had COVID after Christmas? That's unfortunate. Sorry to hear that. Dude, I'm stuck. Okay. I won, barely. I almost fucked it up at the end. Thank you. I, I never expected this. May I ask to what I owe this generosity? Let's just say I like to do a good deed from time to time. Can we get those placards now? I'll bring them to the Rosemary in time. Just as soon as I settle my obligations. Fine. See you there. All right. Another quest down. And I saw there's another quest here. There's, some, there's somebody up here who has a quest. Let's see what it is. Hello, hello. Oh, it's probably just a racing thing. If you've coined for the rider's fee and a steed of your own, why not? Decide quickly, please. There's a race about to begin. Everyone except for your kid got it. Uh, that sucks that everybody got it, though, regardless if you're... I mean, it's nice that your kid didn't get it, but it sucks that everybody got it. Seems like it's going around pretty hard right Rand, now during the season. Your name and the name of your steed. Geralt of Rivia on Roach. Excellent. Your opponent, let me see. I'm just going to do one of these races, even though James I just did Holt one. Astride Athos. I didn't realize it was going to be this kind of thing. That's fine. We'll just do one. Beat the first rider. The Memorial Derby is what this is called, huh? So I think I have to steer. It's not one of those roads where you can just hold A down. I like that you can kind of get in the way. <laughs> Some Legend of Zelda Ocarina of Time bullshit, you know what I mean? to the end here. Yup, yup. Hear ye, hear ye. The final of the Erasmus Vagelbart Memorial Derby is over. The winner is Geralt of Rivia. I guess it takes a second. Not bad. That's a long message. Yet we should already kid ourselves. The competition was hardly stiff. Shall I sign you up for another? Not right now. I'm not here to do this right now. Alright, back to the quest I was working on before that one got found. Where's the cabaret one at? That's the one we're working on. Alright, let me read what you said there. See if I can catch what you said there. You and your sister both got the antibody. I'm assuming you mean the vaccine. Put in the trash system. It's a new thing they're doing. If you have asthma, diabetes, or weight, you can get it, but you have to have the symptoms, but you can only do it like... I think it's a couple days after Simpsons go away, I guess, and we got that. That's why I think that made us feel so much better, but you have to wait like two months before you can get the vaccine or get the booster. Huh. Interesting. I don't know about all those details there, Christine, but... A interesting. On four hooves. Look at that Either way, I hope you're doing all right now. I know you said you had COVID, but hopefully you're doing all right now. I am confused as to where I am on the map and where I know where I need to be. I need to go the opposite direction of where I'm going right now. I think it's just over here and I'm being dumb. Alright, back to the cabaret. It's not available in all the states yet. Huh. Well. Alrighty then. Start in G major. Well, well. See, the crew's been hard at work. Not bad. No, no, not all. But I'd imagine something more, you know, 
More theatrical. What about Rotlick? Did you get the placards? Rotlick said he'd bring them on his own. Should be here soon. Great! The best way I can think of to promote the chameleon. Never mentioned wanting to change the name. Rosemary and Thyme wasn't all bad, but it conjured images of Tumerian cuisine served by waitresses in peasant garb. Chameleon's a lot better for a cabaret, apart from which it emphasizes that the place has undergone a transformation. Just a better ring to it all round. What about choreography? Prepared anything special for the opening? We haven't. But Polly has. She's priceless. Came in and brought the girls in line before I could say knickers. Premier will have the audience on their feet, on their knees, both at the same time. That's not possible, but sure, let's see it. Guess everything's ready. So when's the opening? Soon. We start our dress rehearsal in an hour. I just need to knit back home for my dress. Thanks for everything. Don't mention it. Right. Seems my cabaret dreams are about to come true. So, around to celebrate? I'm buying. Gladly. Why not? That's my boy. Yo, what up, KN? Welcome to the stream, man. How you the doing? The foreman mentioned he saw you and Priscilla talking. He saw right. And she say anything about me? I'm doing pretty good. How about yourself? <laughs> she said you're fat in your smell. She said something that made me think she's not entirely normal. What? That you're responsible. Got your feet planted firmly on the ground. You're pulling my leg. Not this time. That's what she actually said, weirdly enough. One you were doing pretty me. good. That's good to hear, man. How do you manage to get the loan from Sophronia? Oh, wasn't easy. She got so excited about our performance, I had to read to her for four hours. Four hours from the cloak and the dagger. You mean you didn't? Are you crazy? Who do you think I am? She knew how important this night was to me. Of course she did. Probably just making herself gorgeous. Takes time to play. So it's true. A woman's vanity knows no bounds. <laughs> Ask the dandelion. Priscilla, she's... What? Speak, man. She's badly, uh, been attacked. They, they took her to Vomerius Hospital. Attacked? She's hurt? Geralt, come with me, please. Of course, let's go. Who the fuck hurt Priscilla? We're gonna fuck some shit up. How dare somebody? Gods. 